a Sigma's personality qualities make him adept at dispute resolution. While he is an honest man who speaks directly, he also has a level-headed demeanor that allows him to handle conflicts without creating drama. Numerous individuals have no notion how to diffuse uncomfortable circumstances. As a result, when they dispute, they frequently exacerbate the situation. Conflict resolution is an essential social skill that may be applied to all facets of one's life. Here are eight ways Sigmas can be direct without offending others. Number eight, Sigmas never vie for social standing. Alphas and Gammas desire social prominence among men. Because they compete for greater positions wherever they go, they generate a great deal of tension. They frequently employ deceitful strategies that tear others down. The alpha male bulldozes any perceived threat, while the gamma resorts to passive hostile tactics. In both circumstances, their activities are motivated by a tremendous desire for social status. Obviously, sigmas are indifferent to social acceptance, hence they never fight for social position. Sigmas are competitive, but their competition is for a different prize. The Sigma's primary objective is to live a meaningful life. To exemplify this concept, compare two musicians, an Alpha and a Sigma. The Alpha creates music because he desires fame and to leave a musical legacy. He desires that his name be remembered in 200 years. These are characteristic Alpha motives. In contrast, the musician from Sigma is not concerned about fame or legacy. Rather, he is obsessed with his art form and desires mastery for its own sake. This is an internal objective that he thinks significant. Sigmas may be frank without offending others' sentiments because they never bring up social position during an argument. If a Sigma confronts you, he is attempting to solve a legitimate problem. He never makes a minor issue into a prestige struggle. Number 7. Sigmas approach conflict with equilibrium. Because conflict resolution is applicable to fields such as business, politics, and education, scholars have researched it. They have discovered two primary approaches to conflict. Individuals either avoid or seek out confrontations. People who avoid conflict are afraid of the consequences. They do not wish to create an out-of-control situation. They are often referred to as nice guys among men because they never intend to hurt anyone's feelings. Unfortunately, their personalities have the potential to come across as ingratiating. In contrast, those who actively seek confrontation prefer to confront difficulties head-on. In the male hierarchy, alphas prefer fighting since they are skilled at it and usually prevail. They are unconcerned with hurting others' feelings and will engage in conflict without hesitation, especially if it helps them acquire prestige. Sigmas are an excellent compromise between these two approaches. On the one hand, a Sigma avoids conflict because he dislikes drama and would rather avoid the unpleasant repercussions of fighting. If he determines, however, that confrontation is inevitable, he will enter it without fear. In other words, a Sigma is adaptable and will customize his strategy to each unique circumstance. Number 6. Sigmas are excellent character assessors. Misunderstanding the motives of others causes a significant amount of conflict. An excellent character judge is someone who studies the individuals in his everyday life and recognizes subtle clues. He is attuned to nonverbal communication, observing tone of voice and body language. These observations aid in his comprehension of his environment. Being a competent character judge pertains to low-level conflict because, if you understand the individuals you're working with, you can anticipate their emotions and behaviors. For instance, if you observe someone with classic alpha male characteristics, you should not be surprised if he attempts to assume leadership. And if you have to work with a gamma, you won't be surprised by his passive-aggressive statements. It is crucial to be a good judge of character since it aids in social interaction. Sigmas are excellent character evaluators because they observe people intently and can modify their approach to conflict based on the circumstances. Number 5. Sigmas select a logical strategy. During disagreement, individuals frequently amplify problems and make them larger. As a result of their overwhelming emotions, they lose concentration and forget the actual issue. When this occurs, many people act rashly. They say and do things they later come to regret. This is because they lose concentration and allow their emotions to cloud their judgment. Sigmas choose for a logical approach to disagreement. Thus, Sigmas adhere to the facts. Understanding the facts is the first step toward a peaceful resolution, since you cannot fix an issue if you do not comprehend it. 
As a result of this rational approach, Sigma is an excellent listener, as he desires to hear everyone's perspective of the facts. And to ensure that his arguments are sound, a Sigma will consider potential counterarguments to his own perspective. All that matters is focusing on the genuine issues. Sigmas are skilled in conflict resolution because they always bring people back to the truth. A Sigma will not allow his opponent to sidestep or alter the subject. As a result, Sigmas generate less drama because they build their arguments on facts. Number 4. Sigmas maintain their composure under pressure. When it comes to dispute resolution, there is one emotion that demands special consideration, fury. An intelligent approach to anger control will aid in dispute resolution. And while there are numerous varieties of anger, wrath and passive-aggressive behavior are the most problematic. Sigmas avoid both of these categories. The rager is a person prone to explosive fits of rage. Alpha males are frequently susceptible to this temptation. Some guys constantly overreact, and anger becomes one of the defining characteristics. They earn a reputation for having a short fuse. Ragers will occasionally resort to violence and intimidation during a fury. A gamma guy, on the other hand, is typically a passively aggressive man. He experiences a smoldering wrath that manifests his sarcastic, underhanded conduct. Gammas avoid violent conflict at any costs. They prefer to engage in sabotage from the shadows. Gammas engage in gossip and conversations behind your back. Their passive-aggressive approach can make working with them challenging. A Sigma has two responses to anger. Either he remains cool since he is indifferent to the event, or he becomes somewhat irritated. In both instances, he avoids harsh responses. Therefore, you will never witness a Sigma throwing a temper tantrum or hear him making passive-aggressive remarks. His ability to regulate his temper makes him less prone to drama. Number 3. Sigmas are impartial. When a Sigma is involved in a quarrel, he seeks a peaceful resolution. However, not everyone has such noble motives. When some individuals engage in confrontation, they do it with the intent to inflict harm or exact retribution. A Sigma's objective is to find a solution that benefits all parties. Obviously, it is not always feasible to please everyone. Nonetheless, a Sigma will consider your interests, and he will attempt to reach a fair resolution. It returns to the issue of rationality. When engaging in interpersonal conflict, you must be able to rationalize your behavior. In a court of law, judges seek plausible justifications for your actions. Similarly, when Sigmas attempt to resolve a problem, they search for logical answers and have a balanced mindset. Even if you disagree with Sigmas' approach, you will at least comprehend its reasoning. Consequently, Sigmas make excellent leaders while disliking the position. Sigmas are fair, not because they are moral paragons, but Bekai. Shay they employ reasoning to handle dispute, and rational answers are frequently also fair-minded. In addition, this strategy avoids drama because individuals do not feel wrong. People are more ready to cooperate when a Sigma can properly explain his decisions. Number 2. Sigmas are adept at letting the past go. Sigmas' capacity to let go of the past is another reason why they can be straightforward without creating drama. During a fight, some individuals take the event personally and develop long-lasting resentments. Sigmas, on the other hand, are ingrained with a focus on the current moment. Sigmas only consider the past when they need to learn a lesson or correct a mistake. Other than that, Sigmas never dwell on unfavorable occurrences. Therefore, if you had a conflict with a Sigma in the past, he has likely already forgotten about it and will never consider the problem again. He never replays the situation in his memory and harbors no ill will toward you. This ability to let go lessens drama by allowing individuals to concentrate on the future. In the job, for instance, Sigmas can carry on as if nothing has occurred. Occasionally, fighting can even aid in addressing underlying issues and improving working circumstances. Due to their capacity for letting go, Sigmas are excellent employers and supervisors. Number 1. Sigmas carefully consider their words. The words you use during dispute will impact the outcome of the event. And while Sigmas usually consider their words before speaking, they pay particular attention to them during confrontation. There are numerous reasons to contemplate before speaking. Prior to speaking, a little pause for thinking allows you to clarify your thoughts. This will prevent you from using inappropriate language at inappropriate times. Second, when you choose your words wisely, others will comprehend you better, and you will prevent misunderstandings. 
Finally, considering your words before speaking helps you refocus on the situation's reality. As we've seen, focusing on the facts helps to calm down emotionally charged individuals and reduce drama. Therefore, Sigmas pause for a moment before speaking and strive to use words precisely. Hopefully, this article has elucidated the Sigmas' straightforward yet composed attitude to dispute. The capacity to manage the social sphere boosts one's likelihood of achieving success, hence the Sigma approach to conflict is a competitive advantage. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And do share with your friends so we may continue to create them. To see more videos like this, subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Additionally, make sure to check out our other videos. Thank you for watching.